run very long, especially in this hot weather. Okay. I'm going to wait on the second one over here until I get the first one in to put the second coat on because it still needs about 30 seconds or more to actually get tacky. There we go. Okay. And every time you quit using this, be sure and put the lid on because if you accidentally bang it and it falls, you're in deep trouble. <laughs> <laughs> deep trouble. Because it is messy and very hard to clean up. Okay, then I'm going to put it over away from uh, this uh, the dog here. Okay, and she's going to come over here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you're not helping a bit. Come here. Come here. Oh, gosh. She's too heavy. <laughs> she's not much of a puppy anymore. No, she's not. <laughs> no, she's not. I'm going to try and turn her so you can kind of see what I'm doing. She's a good little model, though. Yeah, yeah. She's had this done a lot, <laughs> so she knows what we're doing. That's for sure. Yes, all right. Now, what I'm going to do is, it's kind of had about 30 seconds here or so to get a little tacky. If the glue gets to be um, dull, you know it's not tacky enough. It's beyond the point of being sticky. But if it's still a little shiny, but not... Uh, not so much that you are going to be slipping and sliding when you put it in the ear, then you're good to go. It's kind of halfway between. And you get a hang, you get you get a handle on it. There we go. Okay. Now turn your head. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put this remember sticky side toward the ear, and then we're going to put the uh, cotton ball way down in. Okay, but make sure you get the cotton ball way down in. That's, I'm trying to stay out of the way of the camera You're here, right. and it's hard to work I'm with. I'm going to bug you, so. Okay, okay, there we go. Okay, and we're going to get it way down in there, way down in the base of the ear. Okay, and what we're going to do is, we're going to put it toward the front of the ear, not into the bell, okay? And the glue kind of rubs off your fingers pretty easily when, when you get them full of glue and it just goes everywhere, but it's not too bad to get rid of. Now, okay, you hold your head up here. Okay, you hold your head there. Okay, now what we're going to do is, we're going to pick up on the ear to flatten out the indentation behind this little flap of skin, and we're going to pull it straight up and a little over the top of her head, not forward, not backwards, straight up and over the top of the head. We have to compensate for all this excess uh, skin up here on the top of their heads. Put your head over here. That's a good girl. Now I'm going to pull up over the top of the head and now I'm going to push down as hard as I can and I'm bending it right into that indentation and straight up the ear like that. Okay. There we go. And then I'm sticking it to everything. There we go. That's a good girl. That's a good girl. Yes, I know. Come on, put your head over here. That's a good girl. Now, you've got a second or two, or a few seconds, I should say. If it isn't quite right, if you don't like it, if you want to push it down again, you can always pull it off and continue to do what you want to do. Push down hard, pull it up over, and bend it right into that indentation. Okay. There we go. That's a good girl. Good girl. Good girl. That's a good girl. Okay. And just squeeze it tight. Squeeze it tight. Make sure, because there's bumps and things that stick out in the ear, you want to make sure that the tape goes around or the glue goes around those things and it's way down in the base of the ear. It, when it's in the base of the ear, it's helping to hold the ear up. And then when we get it in the ear where we want it, I'm going to go on the side of the ear where I can actually see the ear itself. To cut off the excess. I'm going to come over here. Okay. Then I'm going to cut off the excess, making sure you don't cut the ear. And don't pull it out this way in order to do it. Keep it upright. Okay? And you can kind of shave it off a little bit just to make it look a little better. Hold step. Hold step. There you go. That's close enough. Yeah. Okay. Then we take 
when we're happy with what we got, we take that piece of tape and I just, I'm going to put some on the back side, half of it on the back side, and some of it on the, the actual um, post as well. And that will hold it in place until such time that the glue is solid. You can take it off by the following morning, that's fine. Because um, it's the glue, if, when they shake their head after they get this freshly in there, they shake their head. It might split the uh, ear from the post if it hasn't got something holding it there to keep it solid until it's actually glued and glued tight. Right. I'm going to put some on the back side, half of it on the back side, and some of it on the, the actual um, post as well. And that will hold it in place until such time that the glue is solid. You can take it off by the following morning, that's fine. Because um, it's the glue, if, when they shake their head after they get this freshly in there, they shake their head. It might split the uh, ear from the post if it hasn't got something holding it there to keep it solid until it's actually glued and glued tight. Right. And I can show them how it's, it's dulled out. The, the, the glue on this is dulled out and that means it's not very sticky at all as you can see I can put my fingers on there and there's very very little stickiness uh, so now is when we put the second coat on it okay yeah he can go outside so that's fine yep, yep. Um, good question oh I bet he yeah in there in the bathroom oh he's in there yeah <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Nope, sit, sit, stay, sit, sit, right there, right there. Stay oh, there. Sleeping. Good girl, Winnie. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's nice and cool in there. <laughs> yep, yep. You've got to stay yeah, on yep, the table. Yep. You're not done yet. No, not You're yet. You're only half done. Yep, yep. You've got two years. Yep, unfortunately. There we go. Okay, so I put it on a little thicker for the second coat because the first coat is already kind of sucked up by the white tape and we want it nice and tacky and then put the top on oops it stay <laughs> okay we'll give it about 10 15 seconds here maybe blow it in the wind a little bit okay and then we put this on the bottom and it will kind of roll up that end of it Put this in over here. Okay, stay right there. Stay right there. Okay, I keep wanting to put it in the wrong way. Um, okay, now we're going to do the same thing. Whoops. Put it in the base of the ear, tucking it down in as far as it'll go, pushing it down. Okay, and I got all kind of goo <laughs> on me. Okay, then we're going to. Pick your head up. Pick your head up. That's a good girl. Okay, we're going to pull up on the ear, put it over the top of her head, push down hard, while we're, and don't follow it when you're pushing down with the tube. Um, pull up, push down, and bend it right into that indentation we just spoke of. And then glue it into the ear. Okay, there we go. All right. If the tip doesn't quite make it, you can move it over a little bit. Okay, there we go. Good girl, good girl. Make sure it's stuck everywhere. Put your head over there so we can see what we're doing. There we go. Kind of hard with black tape. <laughs> <laughs> on a black dog, yeah. Yeah, on a black dog. <laughs> there we go. All right, that's good. Then I'm going to go on the other side. You can kind of see where it's at, but. Um, when they're holding it up, you can see how they look. And if it's you know way off to one side or something, that's when you might want to pull it off real quick and then put it back up with more tension. The tension and the pull-up push down is the key to this whole thing. And I'm going to still got glue all over me. Um, I'm going to cut off the the tip. All right, making sure I can see the tip of the ear. Ugh. Boy, those things are strong. Okay, there we go. And just kind of form it to fit the ear a little bit, just so it looks good. That's strictly to look good. Cosmetic. Cosmetic, that's the word. <laughs> yeah. 
Yes, sir. Aesthetics is what I was trying to find in my, my, my brain, but it wasn't working. <laughs> yes, sir. And the white tape's just temporary, right? Just temporary. Yep. 24 hours tops. Tomorrow morning's fine. Even later on today. It'll, you'll see it kind of halfway coming off anyway, and when it does, just mm. take it off. Give it a couple hours at least. If that's, uh, you know, all you need, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. That's a good girl. Oh, so much glue on my fingers. Oh, yeah. What's this? What's this? What's this? What is this? You'll find that they'll pout for a little while. She's pouting right now. <laughs> yes, she is. <laughs> but when they get to where they're used to it, they will start using their ears and building up the muscles that actually pull the ears up anyway. And so that's why I don't use a bridge. I'd rather have them use their own muscles. And it just makes it a lot easier. There you go. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> there we go. she popped them up. <laughs> yep, yeah. yep. There we go. Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> That's a good girl. Oh, yes. Sit. Sit, sit, sit. Winnie Poo Poo. Sit, sit. Winnie. Yeah. Winnie, yeah. Winnie, Winnie. Winnie, Winnie, Winnie. Winnie, 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 Winnie. Winnie, Winnie. Oh, you're being a brat. <laughs> That's far from the court. They do actually stand. Her, mm -hmm. her ear set is a little bit low anyway, so that's why I really crank on them over the top of their heads. If your puppy has a uh, little higher ear set, which most of them do, uh, you may not have to crank quite as hard, but you still have to push down and pull up. That's still the key. There you go. <laughs> good girl, good girl. <laughs> That's a good girl. I know you hate this too, but it's easier than any other method I've found, and it's easier on them. You don't tear all the hair off the inside or the outside of the ears, and they get they can breathe because only half of the ear is not out in the open, so it makes it a lot easier on them. And you don't get that sore in the front either. We're using no, wrap around. yeah. When you wrap around the yeah. base, a lot of times you get, get a, a sore here. right here where the. Uh, where it comes across where the, the base tape is and sometimes if you tape too too tight at the tips You'll lose your tips because you, you've got them too tight cut off the circulation So this you have no chance of cutting off the circulation because these aren't on very long and it's very tough to get too too right. tight on that mm -hmm. definitely yes yeah. Plus you're going with the vein too actually Yes, with that yes too. You definitely yes. There you go There you go Good girl, yeah. What's this right here? Come on. Yes, sir. Good boy. Good girl. Yep, yep. <laughs> She's used to too many sounds. <laughs> You're not going to trick me today. No, no, not going to trick me. That's for sure. But they will use them and pick them, well, pick them right straight up once up they get used to it. Close up with the ears. Uh -huh. there, yep, there. yep. Yes. Yes, sir. Yep. There we go. That's for sure. That's for sure. And that, like I say, leave it in a week. When it gets ready to come out, it's going to start getting unstuck from here to here. And I just take the, the bottom and pop it out and then just rip up real quick because there's very little hair on the inside of the ear anyway. And it just comes off very quickly. I wouldn't go inch by inch by inch because that would make it one little hurt. hair at a yeah. time, which would hurt. <laughs> so I just do it quick. Rip it like a Band-Aid. <laughs> Rip it like a Band-Aid, that's for sure. That's for sure. You're a pretty girl, Benny. Yes, you sir. are a pretty girl. There you go. That's a, pretty, a good girl. Pretty girl. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> yes. Are you a pretty girl? Are you? Huh? Yes, sir. But if you have questions, you can, you're more than welcome to give me a holler. Uh, my number is 734-461-0730, and I'm more than happy to help you. Yes, sir. Good luck.